Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray getting ready to bring you all the action accompanied by my broadcasting partner Stuart Robson and without doubt a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Brazil versus Argentina. Thanks Derek. Well often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. The starting 11 for Brazil. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Fernando plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And leading the attack today is Roberto Firmino. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line today is Paulo Dybala. And so the match is underway. Brazil moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? In with a chance. And it's come off the keeper. And there it is. A goal. I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Di Maria possession changes hands the interception there Roberto Firmino Gabriel Jesus well they have the ball once more beautifully disguised ball Reflex action from the goalkeeper. Messi with the corner. Goalkeeper's ball. It was always going to be that way. Alex Teres has it. Casemiro. It's with Roberto Firmino. Giving the ball to the opposition that time.
Messi. It's with Dybala. Marcos Acuna. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Fabinho. Here's Fernando. Keeping the ball moving. Oh, good looking run. Well, simply couldn't beat the first defender. Easy save. Lo Celso. And he takes it away. Roberto Firmino. Now Casemiro. Neymar. Here's Tevez. Fabinho. And he read it well. He's in behind. Can he finish? And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So back underway following the equaliser. Roberto Firmino. Here's Fernando. Firmino. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. Space and time for the cross. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Lo Celso. Di Maria now. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Lo Celso going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Neymar. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Encouraging move this from Brazil. Fabinho. Body in the way. Well, for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. He's in here. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Alex Tellez has it. It's with Roberto Firmino. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And attempting the through ball. The end product just wasn't there. Can he give them the advantage? Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. The delivery from Neymar. Well, still an issue here. So, the whistle then. We're up. And so, the match is under... So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. 
It's looking promising. Neymar makes his way forward with purpose. Options around him. Not a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Great pressure to win the ball back. Perfect tackle. Paredes. On to Messi. And a good-looking ball. The high press was very much on. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Well, Paulo Dybala brings real dynamism and creativity to the table. Hard man to handle here. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Casemiro. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Neymar. And he takes it away. A chance maybe from the wide position. Can he finish? That is a splendid goal from Angel Di Maria. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So they get the ball moving again. Can Brazil come up with an answer here? Lo Celso. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. But then the one that fails to hit its target. Well, there it is. Brazil have controlled the possession, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Messi. He'll have a go here. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. And time for the change now. Over it comes. Able to get his body in the way. Corner once more. Fired over by Messi. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. No worries for the keeper. Twenty minutes to go. Well, the fans are driving their team on here, but can they respond with a goal? Time is running out. Fernando. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Could be a chance to break here. Slipshod passing. Well, as we approach full time, we have to say, playing away from home hasn't been a problem for them. Can they see it out? Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it's been a really good contest, you have to say. But overall, I think they've just about deserved to be in the lead here. Can they now just see this going through for what will be an excellent win? Losing possession. And providing width. Well, possibilities inside the box. 
Dybala. Now Messi. Now the attack fizzled out. Well, the counter chance looks very real. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not... And the keeper's hand does the trick. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. So a personnel change then. Romero. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And there the attack ends for now. Marquinhos. Fabinho now. Neymar. This might be ideal for the counter. A deft clearance. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end. Well, as is often the case, Angel Di Maria was a real handful for opponents. Interested to know what you made of his performance. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal. And so the match is underway. In with a chance. And it's come off the keeper. And there it is, a goal. I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Reflex action from the goalkeeper. He's in behind. Can he finish? And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. The end product just wasn't there. Can he give them the advantage? Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. A chance maybe from the wide position. Can he finish? Able to get his body in the way. Corner once more. 